Welcome to the Frugal Studio, the three-in-one overhead camera mount. I had a need for an overhead camera mount to make videos for my YouTube channel and to use as a copy stand to photograph paintings and documents. Being frugal, my first thought was to buy a cheap camera stand. I scanned the internet to see what one would cost. Not frugal. I also looked at the option of building my own copy stand. There are a lot of people who had the same idea. Their designs went from the flimsy to the complicated, some of which would have cost me more just to buy the tools to make the copy stand. It occurred to me that all I needed was a way of suspending a camera overhead. Duh! What could I use? In an inspirational flash, I thought of a sawhorse. I had a couple of folding ones. I took one into the studio to see if it would fit on the top of my drawing board. Yay! It did! All I had to do was drill a hole in the center of the top bar to fasten a piece of wood to mount the uniball attachment to my camera. As you can see, the sawhorse has all kinds of places to mount clamp lights. The top of the sawhorse is an excellent place to put the power bar for the lights. I used some cable ties to attach the light cords to the light clamp itself to make for easy and untangled removal. I can also plug in my camcorder to the power bar so as not to deplete the battery while I'm working. I wanted to tilt the drawing board to accommodate a more comfortable working position. This made the sawhorse unstable and likely to tip over. The solution to this problem was to attach the legs on each side of the horse to a 1x2 with pipe clamps. I then secured the clamped 1x2s on each side of the horse to the drawing board with some wood clamps. A friend of mine seeing this contraption couldn't decide where I fell on the side of the line dividing genius, dividing genius and insanity. No matter. An added bonus is my black foam core folding still life stage that fits into the arrangement perfectly. My total cost for this arrangement worked out to about $15. That included the ball mount, which I had already purchased from eBay, and the four pipe clamps that I bought from a hardware store. The whole effort took less than an hour to assemble. I can now mount my video camera or my still camera on the sawhorse, and I can also photograph subjects in the, in the still life stage. That makes the assembly useful for three activities. It doesn't get any better. Many thanks for watching. There are many more Frugal Studio projects coming. Please subscribe to my channel and enjoy the upcoming Frugal projects. Take a minute to give me a thumbs up or leave a comment. I would really enjoy hearing from you. Have a great day and keep up the Frugal thinking.